at the first sign of a cold, do not use Zycam. That's the message from the feds. The warning issued for parents and children. Plus, what about other zinc-based medicine? What Zycam safety may use? let you take charge of your allergies, but the government says it may also take your sense of smell away. That's the complaint from more than 100 people who've used the popular cold remedy. Tonight, the FDA is telling you, stop using Zycam. NBC Bay Area's Marianne Favreau is here with a closer look. Marianne. Well, Jessica, the people we talked to tonight who use Zycam swear by it, saying it helps them battle a cold ASAP. And it's those same people who say they plan to keep on using Zycam despite the FDA warnings. Ray Baiko rarely goes anywhere without his secret weapon. I have it in my pocket or I have it in the car. He often uses it daily. It, when anybody tells me that they're sick, I just go right to it. More than 130 people aren't such fans. They reported losing their sense of smell after using Zycam swabs or gels, prompting the FDA to tell consumers to stop using the products. Some scientists believe it's the zinc in Zycam that may damage nerves in the nose. I would not overinterpret this to mean that all zinc is bad. What appears to be the case, based on the emergence of these reports, is that likely chronic installation of a zinc-containing product in the nose can have these particular side effects. On its website, Zycam's manufacturer posted this statement saying the company believes these products are safe and believes the FDA action is unwarranted. Naturopathic doctor David Hogg suggests Zycam users turn to natural remedies instead, including using a neti pot for a nasal rinse. The best thing to use besides a neti pot is quercetin, and then, of course, with vitamin C. Ray, however, says his sense of smell is as strong as ever, and he plans to stick with his favorite cold buster. I would certainly use it. Why? Because I think it works. I think it shortens the duration of a cold. Well, this isn't the first time the FDA has received complaints about Zycam. They first started coming in 10 years ago. And three years ago, the manufacturer agreed to pay $12 million to 340 customers who claimed they'd lost their sense of smell. Zycam's manufacturer, Matrix Initiatives, has suspended shipments of these products and will reimburse anyone who wants a refund. Marianne Favreau, NBC Bay Area News.